guys, welcome back. I feel so uncomfortable sitting in these jeans. <laughs> So in today's video, I have been doing so much shopping, guys. It's actually becoming a problem. Who else is feeling like that right now? Just being in lockdown and not having really much else to do apart from go clothes shopping. So in today's video, I thought I'd buy a few things that I'll probably be buying at this time of year to go on holiday with, but of course we are in lockdown. So I have done a holiday haul for you guys because I thought it'd be pretty fun. I was kind of sad when I was doing it because I was like, oh, I'm not even going on holiday, but... I thought it'd be quite fun to do anyway. So this is the first item. I've actually been looking at this item for such a long time. I looked at purchasing it last year, but I just didn't get around to doing it. One of those, I can't even remember the name. I'm just gonna call it hat. It's a, a little hat, really summery, just basically tie it on together. And I'm not sure how I plan on wearing at the moment, but you just wear it over your head. I don't know if to do it like under my ponytail or over, but I thought it'd just be really cute to wear with a bikini. When you're swimming or, you know, sunbathing, you can just put a little hat on. It's just so easy, convenient. And I thought it was really nice and summery. Now I did look at this bag. I believe I got this from ASOS. I really love the color. It's like a creamy color. I wouldn't even call it really a nudie color, but it's something nice and light. And I like going for nice light colors when it is summertime. It's not a too big bag either. I always find, because I'm small, everything looks so oversized with me. It's like when I go clothes shopping and you see oversized hoodies. Hoodies for me are already oversized. So when I do buy oversized hoodies, it just looks completely ridiculous. But yeah, it has so many different pockets. So you have an inside pocket too. So if you have anything like really valuable then it's it's really good to put in there and then you have a little front one too and i quite like the design of how you have the little handles together what i was a bit nervous about buying this bag is if i have it down someone's gonna keep pulling me and that's just gonna really annoy me i don't know why it's just something that i thought about it's not like an oversized bag it's not a mini either so for me it looks like the right size bag for me it's just really nice to have this top I don't really know the name but it's like a little bit see-through but not completely sheer just a really nice little knotted long sleeve top I didn't know about how I'd feel about wearing long sleeve because obviously when you're on holiday it's gonna be quite hot but I feel like because the materials thin enough I won't get too hot in it it could be something that isn't too sheer where you can see all your bits <laughs> But also really nice if to put over a top of a bikini or something. When I look at this top, I just think you are beach vibes. Now you can't go wrong with plain tops. So another one from Pretty Little Thing. I love the material of this. I actually bought a few from Pretty Little Thing very similar, except it didn't have the same edges as this one. It was like the normal racer tops, but the material is completely different. It was really rough material, so I didn't like that at all. But this is super soft and I love pink. I never used to like pink, so yeah, but now I do. <laughs> now I completely like pink, and it's just a nice plain top, and you can do it up with a pair of jeans, a pair of shorts. You can kind of rely on things like this that they will go with pretty much anything. This is probably one of my favourite items. It's so pretty. I probably can't show you. It's like a little summer dress. I did think that this dress may look a little bit like a bed sheet, but people have said it doesn't look too much like a bed sheet. I think it's because it's white, it does make it look like it is. <laughs> but it's so pretty. You have these really thin straps, as you guys can probably see. And it's really good because what I worry about with white is that a lot of white items that you buy, anything, clothes, tops, or whatever, always comes really sheer. So you can literally see everything. But this is the first layer and then it has another layer underneath. I think it may be too hot to wear during the day as that is when it is the hottest. So I thought that would be a really nice evening dress with a nice pretty pair of sandals and maybe like some similar earrings to what I have now. And this is from Misguided and I really like it. And then it has the ribbed back and then when you put it on... It's, it's a low back as well, which is really flattering, I find. What I bought to go with that, also from Misguided, are these really pretty hoops. The chain detailed ones, and it has just like the normal plain hoops. I don't know if you guys could see very well. <laughs> but yeah, 
These are the multi-pack gold hoops. I just find gold hoops to go with anything. If you want to wear them with a pair of bikinis or I was planning on wearing maybe some hoops with the white dress that I did show you. You just can't go wrong with gold hoops. When I saw this, I completely fell in love. How much of a summery color is this? It's so pretty. So it's one of those plain bathing suits with a slightly lower back as well. I think this is from Pretty Little Thing. Pretty Little Thing. And you have the belt as well and you tie it up. And it has that really nice ribbed feeling as well. I really found this quite comfortable to wear. It wasn't too tight in certain places. It was just really flattering. Really beautiful colour. And I do like the strap detail so you can tighten or loosen it. Every single year I always have this crazy thing that I don't fit into my summer wardrobe anymore. I bought so many pairs of shorts last year and none of them fit me this year. It's just completely insane. So I've had to buy more shorts. Also I did pick these up from Pretty Little Thing. And I really like them. They are quite light blue and I do like the fray details at the bottom. I thought that was quite pretty. But the thing that I did find with these is that they did rise up a bit at the back, which I wasn't too keen on, but I didn't think they looked too bad. So I did decide to keep them. So for another bathing suit, these are from ASOS. And wow, look at this color. Green, it's like a minty green. Not minty green, because I think that's more bluey green, isn't it? But it's bright green. And I did get the thong details because that is the style that fits me it has this really pretty strap detail at the back so pretty the thing that i did find with this is that i do normally go for padded bikinis rather than just completely plain material they don't have any padding in them and i just really like them this color is definitely really summery new pair of glasses how can you do a summer haul without a good pair of sunglasses? These also are from ASOS, but they are from Pretty Little Thing. It took so long to get my hands on these, it was insane. But I really like the design. They're kind of oval, not quite oval, but they're just normally plain back, which I love. And I love buying affordable sunglasses. I just always lose them or I sit on them and break them or, you know, something like that just ruin them in some way <laughs> that i just really like these and these such a nice design these are my next item i can't show you because the screen's not big enough but they're baggy trousers and they are the most beautiful material it's a bit of a thick material it's hard to explain it's thick material it feels like good quality material so slightly thick but not thick in the way that it would be really hot and stuffy. It feels like it would be cool and breezy and I love this colour. This is probably my favourite item out of the haul. I just find it really difficult to find trousers that I love but the thing is is that anything from Pretty Little Thing where I did actually get these from or probably anywhere really I always find that the trousers are so long. It's probably why I completely hate. <laughs> I hate buying trousers because nothing fits me. I'm so small that these are super long. Like literally when I try them on, I need to take this off. But yes, these are really beautiful. I believe they're like linen f effect or linen material from Pretty Little Thing. Now this is just a basic thing that I also picked up from Pretty Little Thing. But it has that square detail to it. A little dress, an evening dress that you can just put with a pretty pair of sandals. And what I did like as well is that when you normally go for basic things, they come quite thin. What I loved about this dress is that it does have the double coverage where your boobs are. And so it does give you that extra coverage as I would say if that's the right word to use can't really go wrong with a plain black dress so this is my last summer item it's so pretty this is the belt as well I think if I take the belt off but yeah the belt does come off I would have liked it to probably been attached to it or something so I mean, I'm a bit worried that it's just going to get lost and then it won't complete the outfit you can take these off and it will completely go loose and you can just adjust it to where you want it. I wanted it quite low down because I don't want it too high. But it's this beautiful knitted material 
and when I tried it on it's not so see-through that you can see everything but it's like a little is it play suit is play suit the right word it's like a little pair of shorts as well it's the short design and when you tie it up it's so flattering because it does bring your waist in and this is just like a casual sitting by the pool kind of like evening thing but it's so nice and breezy and that's what you want when it's super hot what does it actually say knitted strappy play suit with a low back yeah so it has a v front and it has a nice low back as well so that was my last summer item i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope you're staying safe and i will see you in my next video